I did a coaching program not too long ago where about 15 people were with me in Chicago and I asked a question and I didn't expect this. I, I didn't uh, expect to even ask the question, but I asked how many of you thought that when you were coming in here today that you were going to be the, the one who was the most behind, who was in last place, who everyone else was more advanced than you. And about three quarters of the room raised their hand. And I knew some of these authors had, had five to 10 books out, and yet they still assumed they would be the ones who would feel out of place there because they would not have accomplished what the other people in the room had. And I think that's pretty common. I think if I asked that question in a room of 500 people, that we would get the same ratio. And what does that mean? Well, I think it means that we are grossly underestimating our own successes. Think about how 99% of wannabe authors never even write a book. And you have written a book or you are working on a book. That puts you in rare company. And if you've put out more than one book, if you have three books, five books, that puts you in the top 1%, possibly even the top 1% of 1%. And so you need to remember that you are so much further ahead than the people who have an idea of writing. You've written, you've marketed, you've sold a dang book. And that is amazing. So remember that whenever you're feeling low.